after just four games at the University of Ohio, I decided to transfer to the University of Oregon. I'm officially a duck, and I'm the number one corner on the depth chart. One thing for sure, me on this roster, we finna take over the Pac-12. And to kick off my career as a duck, the first play of the season, I get a big hit on this running back in the backfield. A few plays later, he thought he was finna turn up field and go for a big gain. I'm coming full speed downhill, and I lay him out. And then late in the second quarter, I get back to my true form. I get my first pick as a duck. I toe tap it. I completely head top this receiver. I went crazy. At the end of the second quarter, right before the half, my teammates get a forced fumble. They scoop it up and give offense some more good field position. With a 28-0 lead midway through the third quarter, I come out of nowhere and I lay this running back out. Not gonna lie, all these big hits kind of got me gassed. I came full speed thinking I'm gonna slap this receiver and he runs through me like it's nothing. Going into the fourth quarter with a 35 to nothing lead, we add insult to injury and my team may get a pick at this point i'm just having fun i'm trying to bait these routes up and get some more picks i get to this ball a little late but i do secure the tackle we end up demolishing fcs southeast like we're supposed to and i end this game with four tackles and a pick to open up our game against uva i meet this running back in the hole and i light him up i tried to bait up this route a little bit the qb had perfect ball placement but i get back and make the tackle and then later in the second quarter bro i light this running back up again he just couldn't escape me a few plays later i catch this running back running from three of my teammates and i come through and light him up again but right before the fourth quarter uva scores a touchdown and they tie the game up 17-17. Then early in the fourth, I play a little too far off my zone, but I get back and I light this receiver up. Then halfway through the third, I shed this block, I catch this receiver running the jet sweep, and I make a good tackle. The last minute of the fourth quarter, I catch their quarterback trying to secure this first down. I come from my side of the field and I light them up. Offense got the ball back, they ran out the clock, and we end up securing the dub 24-17. They didn't try me too much in the passing game, but I did lead the game with nine big tackles. To kick off our game against Tennessee, I come across the field and make a tackle on the running back. Then halfway through the first quarter i absolutely punished this quarterback then early in the second quarter this running back was on his way to the end zone but i came from behind and secured the tackle then later on in that drive i get shot out of a cannon and i light this running back up on this touchdown saving tackle my teammate hyped me up crazy and on the very next play i get my second pick as an oregon duck another toe tapping catch then late in the second quarter my teammates were struggling to get this receiver down so i come through and i make the tackle then i call myself baiting up this route it really wasn't my zone but it was still my responsibility they make a big game but i do get back down to make the tackle then late in the third quarter I bait this route up to perfection. I get back and I drop what would have been my second pick of the game. Then early in the fourth quarter, I bait this quarterback into throwing this route. And I dive and try to catch a one-handed pick. This would have easily been the best play of my career. But later on that drive, Tennessee's running back walks in for a touchdown. It makes the score 17 to 10. But our offense turned the ball over. They try to throw it over the top and double cover it. My teammate gets the game-saving pick. We get the win at home 17 to 10 and we remain undefeated. I had a pretty good game here at home with eight tackles, one for loss, and a pick. Late in the first quarter, I secured this huge tackle for loss and me and my teammate were getting in the groove early. Then on the very next play, my teammate gets a pick and gives our offense perfect field position to go in and score. Offense went and got a field goal, but starting out the second quarter, I come down trying to bait this route. Quarterback throws a die. I get back down and I make the tackle. Up 17-0 midway through the second quarter. I tried my best to bait this route up, but this receiver actually had more speed than I thought. But I do get back to keep him from going to the crib. But Kyle ended up marching down the field and they walk in for the first touchdown of the game. Early in the third, I'm playing off my zone. I try to bait up this route. The receiver made the catch, but I come down and I make a good tackle. A few plays later, I'm trying to bait up my zone for a pick, but I don't get down fast enough and I just secure a tackle. After that, it was a pretty uneventful game. We get a 38-7 win at home against Cal, and we remain undefeated. And I finished out the game with six tackles and one for loss. Earlier in our game on the road against Colorado, I come from my side of the field and I get this tackle on the running back. But they did end up marching all the way down into the red zone, and they end up securing their first touchdown of the game. Then midway through the second quarter, this receiver runs the worst route in human history, and I get my third pick of the season. Then later in the second quarter, I bait this comeback right up to perfection i get back but i misjudged the ball and i only end up coming out with a tackle then late in the third quarter i got a clean hit on this running back and he treat me like a rag doll and just tossed me out the way like it's nothing up 28 to 7 halfway through the fourth quarter i come down and get this touchdown saving tackle on the running back then on the next play colorado's quarterback throws a dot in the end zone and they make it a 28 to 14 game but bo nix and our offense got the ball back and they ran the clock out and we get a 28 to 14 win over here on the road in colorado i didn't get too much action this game but i made some very important key plays and i leave Colorado with three tackles and my third pick on the season. If you're new to the channel and you missed any of the previous episodes, click the playlist on screen right here. Catch up on the past episodes. You don't want to miss it.